One of the mid-state's most heated political races remains unclear tonight, nearly two days after the polls closed. Controversies at the Central York School District drew global attention, but nobody's watching more closely than our Seth Kaplan, who joins us live in the studio. Hey, Seth. Hey, Alicia. Yeah, four votes. That's what separates these two women, Faith Cattell and Becky Rick. From one another, they have very different views on everything, from mandatory masks to the teaching of racial and cultural issues in schools. Only one of them will be on the Central York School Board. There were eight candidates for four four-year terms. There are clear winners for three of those seats, father and former Major League pitcher Corey Thurman and mother, substitute teacher and biologist Amy Milston. Both Democrats joined the board. Incumbent Republican Tim Strickler, a chief financial officer, keeps his seat. But as for the final four-year seat, Look at this. Republican Faith Casal leads Democrat Rebecca Rick by four votes. Now, you might think, well, it says 100% reported, close race, but election over, right? No, because of these provisional ballots. Yeah, the ones election staff have to check to make sure they're from eligible voters before allowing them to count. That's what they're doing today. There are 50 of those. Yeah, 5-0 in the Central York race, where again, four votes separate these two candidates. Faith Casal tells me tonight she's looking forward to the votes being finalized and is preparing to work hard. Becky Rick says she wants to see every vote counted and will serve the community whether or not she's on the board. Valerie, we could know the result by tomorrow night. All right. Thank you, Seth.